Good morning guys. It's like six in the morning. So peaceful. Um yeah, because I went to sleep like really early, which is not a lot to do here. Um I got up really early, so instead of just laying in bed doing nothing, I thought I'd come down to the beach. Um probably uh go for a little bit of a run and do some exercises because I haven't really done any exercise in a long while. So uh properly so I'm just gonna do like, some body weight exercises, go for a bit of swim. Um, I've got some friends coming with me, some doggies. be a good bit of morning exercise to uh, start your day off. I tell you I've never seen water so clear in my life. Seawater anyway. It's just really nice here. It's really really clear. There's something under water here. I'm not sure what it is. So I'm gonna put my camera under. Some sort of fish. Um, yeah, it's just, uh, I think the coral reef's like just there. Uh, it's really nice, it's like, I feel the nature here, like you step in the sea and all the fish just swim away. It's absolutely amazing. Okay, so I've had breakfast. Um, I went back after swimming and stuff like that, had a shower. Um, I had some breakfast, which is really nice. Um, and yeah, like, I was reading the reviews and people complaining that there's not much um, choice here, but there's loads. Uh, there's, there's, well, there's plenty enough. There's, there's as much choice as there is on the mainland, uh, like restaurants, so you haven't really got a lot to complain about. Uh, yeah, I'm coming down uh, for a walk in the other direction down the beach, and it's really cool because the dogs, uh, they follow you, and then they sort of like wait for you, and then they follow you back as well. And I've got, one over there which is the uh there's a few puppies here like really young puppies and she's the mother of the uh puppies so uh, the older dogs are really friendly um i don't know if i said it yesterday but they use the dogs or oh, ain't use them but the, the dogs help keep away the um all the wildlife out of the uh out of the sort of like resort area and uh they've got a cat as well which also helps with that as well so yeah, they're all really friendly. They'll come along. And uh, one of the guys last night was saying, uh, one of the dive instructors who was here last year, he said he walked down to the uh, village, the fishing village, and uh, one like followed him, and then sort of like stopped halfway and disappeared. And on the way back, it sort of like come out and followed him back. So it's really cool. But yeah, I'll just uh, come for a walk. And like, that's the pier for my resort and my resort's there but you can't even see it <laughs> that's how sort of like small it is that's a fishing village um, so yeah I just thought I'd come for a walk along the beach uh, my little friend that I've made yeah it's really nice here really nice and the sun's come out it's uh, got my dive try dive in about half hour so I thought I'd uh, just come for a walk and now walking back and uh, the dog that's with me just come strolling past with a fish's mouth. It's like, no, oh, no big deal. I've just caught a fish, no problem. <laughs> so what? How did you just catch a fish? That dog's a smart dog. So I'm going in to do my dry dive now. First and last time we're going to do lots and develop. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. 
okay, so that was so awesome. That was so cool. Um, I was down there for a while actually, a bit longer than I was supposed to, be, I think, but it was amazing. Um, and they said that I'd done really well, so yeah, it was really good. I'm going to go out this afternoon as well, or later on, um, and get a. Uh, and we're going to go out to like a proper dive spot as opposed to just on the seabed sort of thing. Um, so yeah, but I um, I was swimming through. And we were swimming through the dock. Um, I cut my finger open. Uh, so yeah, like we kind of come back. Like I swam around with it for a while, and then so sort of I showed the guy, and then we came back. Um, yeah, I'm just waiting for it to dry because obviously when you go swimming, your skin's wet. Um, so uh, just waiting for it to dry so I can put a plaster on it, uh, just to cover it up really, just to uh, keep it nice and uh, clean, as clean as possible. At the uh, the owner, I come up and said, oh, you got a first aid kit, and she's like, yeah, and she just poured iodine straight on it, ah, oh, I've never had iodine before, but it was bloody painful, straight in the cut, yeah, but yeah, no, it was really fun, it was so much fun diving, yeah, yeah, it's, uh, I definitely, you know, it'd be nice to stay here and do something like a proper scuba diving course, but, um, I've spent a lot of time, I'd love to do it somewhere else around the world. Uh, either like Thailand or Australia maybe so yeah I'm going to go sort my finger out and then um, just go and chill for a bit go and order lunch because they do like a buffet lunch here and you've got to order it beforehand um, if you want it so yeah but it was really really good it was so much fun and there was I don't know how the footage came out because I've never used this prop, um, camera properly under water before so hopefully it'll come out alright, um, I'll have to see when I made it in, uh, but yeah, it was, uh, it was awesome. <laughs>
back to well, home, uh, back to the mainland, um, leaves at 4.30 and then I catch a bus to I don't know, see and reap, um, which is an overnight bus which is 10 hours so yeah, I won't really be doing a lot tomorrow. Um, so yes, well, not in the evening anymore, I'll, be, I'll still be here a lot all day. So yeah, do some exploring, island exploring I think probably. There's a few bit there's a few other beaches I might try and get to some of those. Uh, but yeah. It's been a good day. It's been a really fun day. Uh so yeah, thanks for watching guys. Don't forget to subscribe if you want to see more and I'll catch you next time.